Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a haul video. I'm super excited because I have lots of good stuff to show you guys. I have some stuff that I purchased. I have a little bit of PR and I have a choker that makes me look like a cowboy. So today's video is in collaboration with Ebates, which if you guys are not familiar with Ebates, I'm going to give my spiel. Ebates is so awesome. I was so skeptical of Ebates because it's basically they pay you for shopping. And when you first hear that, you're like, mm -mm, nothing's that good. Like that's too good to be true. But they do. So Ebates is a cashback site. So what that means is there are a ton of retailers that participate with Ebates. Each one has a certain percentage that you will get back when you shop there. So I don't know what a ton of them are. Like some people are like Sephora's this and Nike's this and JCPenney's is this. Like I don't know what all of them are. But you basically get money for shopping. So Ebates does specials every now and then where like this week is triple cash back at these retailers. So there's a bunch of retailers right now that are triple cash back until March 6th. So what that means, like if it's usually 2% cash back, it's now 6% cash back. So you get triple the money back than what you normally would shopping at that retailer. So Sephora is not on the triple cash back this week but JCPenney's is. So if you guys are gonna do shopping at Sephora, I would do it through the Sephora's that are inside JCPenney's because then you will get the triple cash back. I just spit so bad. But Nike is usually one and a half percent. Right now, this week until March 6th, they are 12% cash back. So I'm gonna have a link down below for you guys to sign up for Ebates. Once you sign up and you spend $25, you will get a $10, they call it like a welcome bonus, which is really nice. Oh, oh also make sure you guys download the browser button. It makes such a world of difference because when you're shopping, like you're not thinking like, oh, I need to log into my Ebates account. So once you go onto whatever website you're going to, if that website participates with Ebates, this big button pops up on your screen and all you do is click it and it automatically will like log you into your Ebates account. It's a lifesaver. So find like discount codes and coupon codes for you. So the browser button, two thumbs ups. Ooh, something smells really good. And Ebates will pay you quarterly. So every three months you either get a check in the mail or directly into your PayPal account and it's like money back for shopping. So I know I'll always joke with Tony and I'm like, mm, I got my Ebates money. And then he's like, okay, so maybe this, all this shopping that you do isn't so bad. Like, so I think that's all that I wanted to tell you guys, but yes, it is triple cash back until March 6th. So if you're gonna do shopping, do it now. Okay, let's get into the makeup. So I'm going to start with Walmart. I only have a few things to show you guys. But I got this Milani Baked Bronzer in the shade Dulce. So my friend Tara has been using this for, I think, like two months. And she keeps telling me about it. She's like, you need to get it. It's so pretty. And then I was watching Kathleen's Favorites video, and she mentioned it too. And I was like, okay, I really need to get this. It really does look pretty. So it's a matte bronzer, but it has, like, veining through it. Like, I don't want to say glittery because that sounds kind of terrible but it has like glittery veining through it but when you swatch it like I haven't worn it yet but when you swatch it see I'm pretty tan right now so it's a little bit light for me but I think when I'm not self tan this will be really pretty but what I was saying when you swatch it it just looks kind of matte with a little bit of a sheen to it also from Milani I bought this against my better judgment because I had bought like five of these in the past and I ended up getting rid of all of them because I totally hated the formula. These are the Amore Matte Lip Creams, but I couldn't resist this color. It's so, what is that? It's so pretty. This one's in the shade Adorable. It's what I have on my lips right now. Oh my God, you guys, look at that. It's like the perfect pinky nude. It's so pretty. So, I mean, 
it doesn't feel too dry but these are just in my opinion not the most comfortable but no liquid lifts in my opinion are comfortable I'm the worst when it comes to liquid lips I just couldn't resist this color this color is gorgeous I also got these two sponges from eco tools I'm such a savage I was sitting here and I like ripped into the packaging and then I'm like you're filming a haul video, you animal. So I don't even have the packaging to show you guys. I'm so sorry. But these are the two newest sponges from EcoTools. And Tati has been raving about these. So I really wanted to try them out. They feel a little bit like rough. Not rough, but hard. You know what I mean? They're not as soft as I thought they were going to be. I love the shape of these. They have like a really big flat side. And then they have the other side, which is like a little smaller, but it's still like flat at the top. I think they're going to be good. I will let you guys know. And then this Milani setting spray. I did not purchase these. Erin sent me one and Tara got me one. So I had them on alert. I could not find this anywhere and I was dying for it. So I'm like, if you see the Milani setting spray anywhere, please get it for me. Well, they both found it at the same time. So now I have two of them. But I tried this today for the first time, and I mean, it's too soon to tell, but it smells really good. The sprayer is really nice. It doesn't give you like those big droplets all over your face. I have good, I have good vibes from this. Like I feel like it's gonna be good. Um, people are raving about this. People are saying this is the best setting spray they've ever used in their entire life. And I'm like, how is that possible? Like, where the freak? Milani just came out of nowhere with the best setting spray of all time. So they gave me my little birthday gift. My birthday's next Saturday. I'm going to be 25. So it's a little tart blush in the shade Parte. It's really cute. I mean, like, it's adorable packaging. The shade is gorgeous. And then... There's a little lip paint in the shade Birthday Suit. Um, okay, it's like the exact same shade as the Milani one. It might be a little bit lighter, but damn. That's really close. Do you see that? Holy shit. So I'm excited for this little birthday present. I feel like I will use both of them. And then I also picked up the Fresh Sugar Cream Lip Treatment in the shade Buff. I've not heard anyone talk about this, but... I couldn't resist this packaging. It's so cute. And when I swatched it, it looked really pretty. Oh, I put it right over top of the bronzer. Wait, I need a wipe. So it's just a really pretty, like, peachy nude. I can't tell if it has a scent to it. I don't know. But I love the brand Fresh. They're Fresh Sugar Lip Treatment. I always have, like, three of these in rotation. It's my favorite. And then staying on the lip train, I got this Makeup Forever Ultra HD Lip Booster. And when I was checking out at Sephora, the girl who was checking me out was like, oh my god, I bought that. It's amazing. It's like my favorite thing. Like she was raving about it. So I have really high expectations. This one's in the shade 01. There's uh, I think it's like double zero, it's colorless, and then there's zero one, which has a little, just a little hint of color. So it just has like a hint of like a mauve shade to it, but I put this on last night. I'm going to do a close-up so you guys can see the little applicator. It feels so good on your lips, like it's very smooth and it just makes your lips feel so hydrated it's not goopy it's not sticky it's so comfortable I think this is gonna be really good and then I got two setting sprays so I went with the intention of buying the Kat Von D locket setting spray in the full size but they were sold out of it and I was so so devastated like I had the girl looking everywhere I'm like are you sure you don't just have one but she did not have one so I got the little baby one this is so cute but the sprayer on this is the same as the sprayer on the full size it's different from any other setting spray I've ever seen usually with setting sprays you just spray it and it's like a spray this one when you spray it it like it goes like really slow I don't know how to describe it look I'm gonna show you watch
I was worried the little one wouldn't have the same sprayer as the big one, but it does, so I'm a happy girl. I will let you guys know how this is. I I want to love this because I love the sprayers. And then I also picked up, I, I know, I have a lot of setting sprays to try out. The Bosha White Charcoal Mattifying Makeup Setting Spray. What a name. So this I was going to buy in the full size, but it was $38. I'm like, that's insane for a setting spray. So it just, it has this weird like milky white consistency. <laughs> So the sprayer on this one is just normal, but it's still a very fine mist. Just, I don't know if this one has a smell. Did I mention the Milani one smells incredible? It smells so good. I do have to be honest, I have not heard the greatest reviews about this one, but I've been wanting to try it, and I finally was like, you know what, I just need to get it and try it. Oh, this is so exciting. So I've been wanting one of these for so long. This is the Marc Jacobs Liquid Lip Cream in the shade Fawn Over Me. First off, look at this packaging. It's gorgeous. So uh, I'm so excited about this, you guys. Oh my God, this color. Can you see that? <gasps> it's so pretty. I really, really want to love these. My friend Jamie really likes these, so I'm hoping that I do too. It was $28 though, so maybe I don't want to love it. Maybe I want to hate you and return you. So the last thing I got was just a little cologne sample for Tony. This is the Versace. Versace? This is the Versace Eros? Eros? Um, the Greek in me wants to say Eros because I know my family would murder me if they heard me saying Eros. It smells incredible. If your man or you needs a new cologne, oh my gosh, this smells really good. Okay, so I have a few PR items to show you guys. I was not going to throw these in, but you know what? I'm excited about them. It's makeup and I want to share so it. ColourPop has come out with new um, lippy sticks in the cream formula. They have some that are matte, satin, and cream. These are extremely creamy. Like, they re kind of reformulated them. They're creamy. Creamy. I'm just going to swatch my two favorites, but I will pop in a picture of swatches of all of them so you guys can see. Oh my god. When they say these are creamy, they are not joking. Oh shoot, I swatched the wrong one. Okay, we're swatching three of them. Because I got to show you my favorite one. So, Boys Town is my favorite one. This is gorgeous. It's the coolest color. I love it. So, Boys Town. Oh, shit. I'm Yours is the one in the center. And then Bonus Points is this darker one. Gorgeous. I love the cream versions of the lippy sticks. They're so comfortable. They don't get everywhere. Like they're not gloopy and they don't slide all over the place. They're really good. And then Buxom had sent me a PR package with like 40 of these new, what are these called? Plump line lip liners. So they're these like fat lip liners. Um, I used this one today. This one's in the shade Stealth. I am out of room. So this first one is Stealth. This is the one that I wore today, but I mean, of course you can't see it. But this one's really pretty. It's just like a soft, like pinky peachy nude. Okay, this one is Dolly Danger. This one's a really pretty, just like traditional mauve shade. It reminds me a lot of Back Talk from Urban Decay. And oh, I always opened the wrong side. The last one, Oh, well, look at this terrible swatch. This one is Mystery. So it's like a deep berry shade, kind of. These are really nice, though. I mean, I don't know if they do any plumping. I just feel like they're like a fat lip liner, to be honest. But they are really nice. They're not too creamy. They're not too dry. Like, the consistency is on point. I have to talk about this. So this was sent to me as PR, but if you guys have been watching my channel, you know that I love the Bum Bum Cream. I just spit. I'm so sorry. 
<laughs> obsessed with this stuff. I'm not even kidding. The smell will change your life. You will just, you'll die. Come back to life. So they were nice enough to send over their new Brazilian Crush Body Fragrance Mist. You guys, this smells so, I can't even describe what it smells like. It smells like a tropical... It's tropical, but it's not like coconutty. They describe it as a pistachio almond. It just smells like the most amazing tropical getaway that you've ever been on. It's not overpowering. It's not too strong. It's just... Oh my god, I love it so much. Thank you so much to Sol de Janeiro for sending me this. Addicted. And the last thing I want to show you guys are my new Oh my god, they're so cute. So, I saw, I know Nicole Guerrero has these, but I saw someone else with them before I saw her with them. So I went on the Zoomies website, and they were totally sold out. They had like two pairs of nines left, and I'm usually an eight and a half. So I got the nines. They're a little bit big, but oh my god. I'm so excited. I love these so much. They're so cute. I just got them today. I have not worn them. But I'm telling you, dusty pink is just, I just can't get enough. Oh, 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 I forgot to show these to you guys. <gasps> this was I didn't look. <laughs> this was PR, but this was sent to me from NARS. Oh my God, I just realized there's a pencil sharpener. <gasps> just like a regular box of crayons. What? So these are the velvet matte lip pencils. So, so NARS has had the same shades in their line for a long time. I love their velvet matte pencils. I have a bunch of them. Cruella, Dragon Girl, I've worn them in videos. But they came out with 10 new shades. You guys, this one. Okay, are you ready? This one is called Pussy Control. So your neighbor comes up to you and she's like, Oh, what lipstick do you have on? It's so pretty. And you're like, yo, girl, it's pussy control, bitch. That's just what I imagine happening. And I'm like so excited about this, this possible interaction with my neighbor, even though Tara's my neighbor. I mean, it, it could happen. I'll be like, pussy control, bitch. I, I'm living for this moment. This one is really pretty. This one... This one is called Intriguing. It's really pretty. It's like a, a normal, what is normal? It's like a traditional pinky nude that a lot of people will like. And let's do this one. Ooh, this one's pretty. This one is called Do Me Baby, right there. So these are just really nice. They're easy, you don't need a lip liner, you just put it on. They're comfortable. I mean, they do get kind of dry after a few hours, but they're matte. Any matte lip, in my opinion, gets dry after a few hours. So I'm excited about the new shades, especially pussy control. Get your pussy under control, girl. So this was really awesome of NARS to send over. Like this is just it still blows my mind that I get packages like this and it kills me when I see people like YouTubers opening packages and they're like, oh yeah, Nars sent this over. Okay, moving on to the next thing. And I'm like, bitch, it's, it's amazing. And I'm so thankful and it really upsets me when I see people taking it for granted. Yeah, it's just makeup, it's just makeup, but still it's something you should be appreciative for and you're not and I think that's shitty. That's my rant for the day. Sorry. Let's move on. Okay, so that's going to do it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will have all of the information down below about Ebates. Oh my god, this just smelled up my entire body. <sighs> anyway, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys next time. Peace. will take you to another dimension of the world. You won't even know where you are. Your husband will be talking to you and, and you'll just be like, shut the mother blank up because I smell like a Brazilian bombshell. What am I even saying? Get your life. Get your life. I love when people say that because it's like, I already have my life. You get your life. Get your life. Bitch, I got my life. This choker is literally choking me. Like I could pass out at any time. If I just drop over during this video, I don't know, call the authorities, whatever. I'll, I'll, Put all of you in my will to get some of my makeup if this choker chokes me the F out. It's a good day to have a good day. It's a good day to have a good day. It's a good day to have a good day.
that you want to whoop an ass. Two asses. Whoop a baby's ass. I thought I broke that. <laughs> I'm telling you, if April doesn't drop that baby giraffe, I can't take much more. I can't take much more. Why don't they give April a damn C-section? She's been in labor for like three weeks. I mean, not three weeks, but it probably feels like three weeks. Why are you always lying? Why the fuck are you lying?